Okay, that's me again. I'm uh, Heine Hoy, consultant psychiatrist, professor of psychiatry, and editor of Global Psychiatry Archives. And this is a paper we published a uh, few years ago, and it's by a team of people from um, Nigeria. Um, so the, the first author is Dr. Adebayo. The question is about the uh, burnout among early career doctors in Nigeria, and it's a charting study where people have the opportunity to talk together. It's not a, it's not a system of review, it's not a random sample, it's about people who are interested in this issue. So the question is, they talk about burnout, and then they just to talk about these issues, they um, try and find out research jobs and use this uh, discuss, discussion forum to explore burnout among um, early career doctors. Right, so what they, is these people, you know, the people who are interviewed are male, mostly male, 14 people altogether in uh, southwest Nigeria, south south Nigeria, different teaching hospitals, and have different uh, different uh, job titles, house officers, senior medical officer, registrar, and senior registrar. So none of them is consultants. And um, this is a uh, thematic analysis and what they just um, find out there are different causes of burnout. For example, one, one of the um, citations is another thing is counseling. Many people are not looking at counselors, they find themselves in residency, residency in a particular place that they didn't plan for. Some may not be able to handle the stress because it's, there's a lot of stress that comes with specializations, no job description and stress specification. Which hunting in the sense of at the local political level and somebody um some political fight and the person happens to be so you're a senior. So that's one of the problems. Um effects of burnout, more or less uh, very simple. Everybody is stressed up and struggling a struggle, uh, and that's maybe the most important part is how do you deal with that? So people propose regular roundtable discussion should be made by all stakeholders. There should be some psychology support. Um, medical reviews should be done by the management. Um, so there should be more doctors on the on the ground, and there should be more people who uh, stay in the country and not emigrate. We uh, need to increase staff strengths and uh, reduce the issue of the burnout and a larger workforce is uh, recommended uh, working schedules are should be reviewed and uh, let's say a shift if it can the shifts can be incorporated into the shift of medicine it should be an issue with burnout to be uh, reduced anyway and the other important, important point is about the attitude of doctors. Doctors shouldn't see themselves as super human beings. They can always be tired and need rest. Right, okay. So I think that's these are the points. And I think the idea more or less come to the uh, findings, at least in the summary. There are ideas to how to manage burnout, uh, policies restricting long hours, um, provision of medical uh, medicals, increment in doctor size, roundtable discussion about uh, stakeholders, about the problems, psychology review of residents, and uh, these are the things which are proposed. And um, in the, as a conclusion, it is as many, um, many issues to be addressed about burnout, the quality of life needs to be improved of those who work very hard. And um, if you want to read more about this paper, please look at the journal, uh, the journal website, www.globalpsychiatry.co.uk. And if you're interested in more of these short videos summarizing papers, then please subscribe to our channel, Global Psychiatry Archives on YouTube. Thanks for your interest and uh, I hope you have a nice evening. Stop this now.